doing out here? I'm so sorry, Ezio. I'm so sorry. What happened? It was a trick to lower our defenses. As soon as you left, they attacked again. Kedko Orsi, he has the apple. What? No! Where is he? We chased him out here. But the bastards escaped into the mountains. I'm going. You'll not find fairer prices than these, I mean. I've many other items too to harmonize your entire. There he is! I'm not going to go! I've done other things through. Displeasing his holiness the Pope. I'm here with you! Is that a good thing? But you! There! There! Get there! Hold on. I'm here, Fratello! That one is very You think I'm just standing here for fun? You're rather odd one, isn't he? of your strikes. Be patient. Strozo! This day is your last. Die! Die! Who get him? So, you have your prize again. Was it worth it? So much bloodshed. <coughs> A prize of such value. It will not remain yours for long. We shall see. Che miseria nascono dalla vidità. Requiescat in pace.
Don't. Who are you? Stop. Don't open it. Are you all right? What happened to you? I... I don't know. One of my guards had the luck to find you in the hills, next to Kek Orsi's dead body. See... That I remember. Wait... There was a third man. He took the apple. Who? He wore a black robe, like a monk. And I think... A missing finger... See, si. Katerina, I have to go, right away. Of course. Then you will need this as well. The map Nicolo spoke of. Your husband's... Ex-husband, mio caro. He swore he'd uncover the locations of all the Codex pages. You will recover the apple, but you will never find the vault without this. You know, there is an abbey in the wetlands near here, where I've seen monks wearing black robes. I'd start there. Now go. Find us a stramaladetto monk. I think I'm going to miss you, Katarina. Oh, I know you will. That's it. Come back anytime. Expectancy? Uh, about five more years, I wager.
Blessings on you, brother. Grazie. I wonder if you can help me. What do you see? A monk in black robes who lacks one of his ten fingers. Well, Brother Guido has only nine toes. You sure it wasn't a toe? Quite sure. And then there's Brother Domenico, but it's his entire left arm he's lacking. Again, quite sure that it was a finger. Hmm. Now wait a moment. I do recall a black-robed monk with nine fingers. Yes, of course. When we had our last San Vincenzo's feast at the Abbey. Yes, I know the place. I'll try there. Grazie. Go in peace, brother. I always do. Communication! Again, the Brotherhood of Mission. Congratulations and poverty and bombs 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 Brothers, the killer of monks has returned! Assassino! Killer on the loose! Please don't kill me! The Lord be on you! Please, no! I don't want to die! I only kill those who kill others. And your brother Stefano was a killer. I'm sure you are no such thing. Now, listen to me. I'm looking for a black-robed monk who's missing a finger. Missing a finger, you say? Do you mean, like, Fra Savonarola? Savonarola? Who is this? You know him? I did. He was one of us, for a time. And then? We suggested he retire to a hermitage for a good long time. I'm afraid to say his retreat has come to an end. Where would he have gone? Oh dear. Santo Spirito? In Firenze? It's where he studied. Perhaps it's where he would return. I thank you. Go with God, brother. Girolamo Savonarola, a Dominican friar from Ferrara, this man took his job seriously. He saw the excesses of his age, the rich stomping the poor into the dirt, the priests selling indulgences to the populace, and he went insane. Calling himself an instrument of God, Savonarola descended on Firenze. His sermons sent people into frenzies. 
he demanded an end to all personal property, to all progress, a return to Eden. Knowledge became the enemy, and he could erase it all with the piece of Eden at his command. Books, paintings, musical instruments, he burned everything in the bonfire of the vanities. History unravelled as his legions took control, and Firenze descended into darkness. Hey Desmond, I think I repaired that busted memory. Why don't you try opening it? If Piero had only a tenth of his father's talent, we'd still have some place to call home. Never should have welcomed that mad monk into the city. Look at all the misery he's wrought. Sometimes I wish the Assassino would return to Firenze, that we might be free of his tyranny. Salve, Ezio. You picked a fine time for a homecoming. Then it's true. Savonarola has taken control of Firenze. Yes. No doubt aided by that treacherous artifact. We should get to work on retrieving it. That may be more complicated than you think. <laughs> when isn't it? Why don't you fill me in on things? Walk with me. It all started a few weeks ago. The man everyone once reviled was suddenly the one they worshipped. Ah, the apple. Only in part. It's not the city.